Hey everyone, I'm Paul Wontorek, and I am at lunch at Ruby Foo's Times Square with three of my favorite musical theater actors who also happen to be 2009 Tony Award nominees. To my immediate left is Gavin Creel, who is nominated for his <laughs> second Tony Award for playing Claude in Hair. And in the middle, we have Sutton Foster, fourth nomination for playing uh, the all singing, all dancing, much. all farting, all belching, <laughs> Princess Fiona in Shrek the musical. <laughs> and over there, we have Mark Kudish, who plays, and I, you, you have to say the adjectives because I always forget them. The biggest turd on the Broadway stage today. Ooh. Well, there's a list. What's the list? <clears throat> Sexist, egotistical, lying, hypocritical, bigot. Oh, yeah, I'm the biggest asshole there is nice. on the stage. Nice. Franklin Hart in 9 to 5. Yeah. Yay. This is your third nomination. Yeah. So uh, here we are, and it's about a week, a little over a week away from the Tony Awards. So how's everybody doing? How are we all feeling? I'm so nervous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. I feel good. It's great. Yeah, I'm just excited to be Honestly, able to go. Honestly, this is what's exciting. Yeah. yeah. To see your friends and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, the best part of it, right? The best part of it is that you know you're going to get to hang with people that you love that you don't usually get the time to. Right. Well, and you, 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 I didn't bring you here accidentally. You, you all have something in common, which what is, is that, that you starred in one of my favorite musicals <laughs> yeah. of all time, yeah. which won the 2002 Tony Award uh, for Best Musical, Thoroughly Modern Millie, and that was the first nomination for, for all, all three of you. Mm -hmm. oh my and gosh. here we are again. Yeah, but you know, know what's weird? Uh, am I wrong or am I right? Because I wrote this to you. Every time I've been nominated, you've been nominated. I think. I think I'm right. That's well, she's nominated every I year. Know, every time she <laughs> does. <laughs> what I mean is, I mean literally, I think every time that I've had a nomination, you've been nominated in the same year. We've oh, been nominated that's twice so cool. together. Yeah. It's kind so we're of good weird. Luck. We are good luck for each yeah. other. But the best part would be to, for all three of us to be able to work together again. I thought you were going to say win. Well, A, <laughs> B would be to work together again. Yeah, together. that's better. I have a plan. I have a plan in my head. I told you about this, but I think the 10th anniversary in, in 2012. We should do a concert. Oh God! You can lower Why all not? the keys. No, I'm gonna lower all the keys. I'm gonna lower all the keys. I should. I think we should do. A, I think we should I like, I don't put think it I out there. Forget all right, about we're not coming. <laughs> you put a scotch and a cigarette. I think it'd be amazing. I think it'd be a one night fun. concert. Absolutely. You know, you could raise a bunch awesome. of money for a great charity. Please, they're gonna be talking I about. I would revival. totally do it. I think yeah. we should do it. I would totally. Michael do that. and Dick could come back. I bet we could stage it. Michael and Janine would be back. Could we just stand there with? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's exciting that so many high schools are doing it, and I, I get. So many letters. You guys get letters from kids. Yeah. yeah. I get people. Do you have any advice for Jimmy? Oh, really? Yeah. Um, yeah. People are like, "How do you sing that? That? How do you sing it? Yeah. You know? Yeah. Oh yeah. There was a guy. My guy. Like, you don't. Yeah. You struggle. <laughs> well, and the funny thing is, they all sing it like you guys because they study your album. Yeah, that's so, so true. Yeah. But yeah. that happens a lot, I think. I mean, that's what shows. I did when I was doing musicals in high school. I studied the album, or or and now like there's YouTube and I mean there's so much. Oh, no, you can see it. You it's, can actually see it on. It freaks on, me. That freaks it, me out. Yeah. I mean, because then people are mimicking your movements or, or I don't know, I, I'm so glad I didn't grow up in the YouTube time that, that I happened, you know, and I'm an adult. I because would have been one of those obnoxious kids who would have oh, taken videos and posted them. Without a doubt. Oh. And I would have oh. never worked again. People would have gone back and gone, wow, this guy is insane. Because I have, I have um, Or you'd have your own so many... television series right Yeah, now. right. Could be. Let's be honest. Right. Could be, it could be. I have so many tapes of uh, things, of of you singing it like oh yo and torturing my friends and making them do things i, I had so many like music making, videos yeah making i, I was into <laughs> making videos where <laughs> we didn't have like you know there was no iMovie there was no f editing machines so i was big into like standing in front of the camcorder which was as big as this booth oh, with and, pressing, on it, uh -huh, <laughs> and pressing with the, the little red it, circle like, button giant... record oh, and standing totally. in front of it and then having my friend press record and me trying to stand really still and like take my shirt off and then press record again it looked like oh my shirt disappeared and now my shirt's back on I magic <laughs> and it was like a nine hour long video oh. of like the shirt's there the shirt's I there i dig some of that stuff up oh terrible yeah embarrassing good times yeah. yeah oh my gosh Ever. i would yeah, torture you were still, my they still had the crank cameras when you were a kid didn't they mark no <laughs> Dumbass. Because I didn't. The crank camera. I didn't. Yeah, right. Foot pedals. I had to. It was very hard when you were sitting in front of the camera and you were going la, 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 with the cranks. You could fit in front of it. Putting the three of us together on the stage was 
danger, danger, Will Robinson. Well, I, well, have we told so the story? Don't say before? that because have we told the story? I mean, she has done a lot of that? things afterwards. Yeah. There's a recording of the two of us doing. Um, because both of them are trouble. Actually, he's the master no, trouble. Uh, no. No. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm I, saying I the story. I am the rock. No, I'm the rock. You are the rock. I am the rock. This but time, I was not the rock. You were not the rock. See, he's the worst. And this is exactly the formation the little, we were in. The little you were twinkles. sitting there. Yeah. He has the sitting, twinkle. He no. tries to do the twinkle. You, you, it was bad. Right. This no, he gets I a little just, twinkle like he's going to mess with you. He's like, hey, hey, hey. He messes. I just am. I'm not serious. You came on the stage. The two of you came on the stage in that scene, and you were already going. It was Saturday night, and we had some You were already going, and I was sitting there because I was already there drunk, right? So I'm this watching is, the two of you. This is This is Scooby. The character was drunk. This, the character, the character was drunk. Graydon's drunk, and these two this come was a, in. This was an infamous evening and during Millie on a Saturday night where we almost got fired. <laughs> oh, <my laughs> literally, literally. He, he just opened up his mouth to no, say a line. No, yes. this is not how it happened. <laughs> I want the record say that? Right. This is how it happened, you and you know it. Out. And you know this. No, no, no. no. We, we, all, we all had twinkles, <laughs> all of us. And I always have I tried, were fired. I tried to so, play the twinkle game. Fingers. She puts her things out where she's like, she's like, it's like, it da 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 to be our own in the world. And she's got her lips out like this. I remember it like it was yesterday. Her fingers out, you're there, I'm here. And she's standing up, and we both go, whoosh. And look, and look up, up at, at her, me. and right when she does it, she goes. <laughs> <laughs> just starts to giggle, and then I went. And I just I went. remember you trying <laughs> to say a line. It was like, Paha. I could but not. When you laugh, it was awful. Laugh. When you start to lose your shit on stage, this is what happens. <laughs> she puts her head between oh, her legs. Her head just goes she just down. Went, uh, she grabbed her head, and Mark grabbed my shoulders, pulled me to the old position, and said, "Start over." We're starting over. And we start the scene. And I was, and the audience is laughing. By that point, it's like, just, why hide it? Oh, it was awful. We have to start I was, over. I was like, "This is horrible." She literally this was like, is horrible. holding her head. It was horrible. I was horrible. like, "No." And the audience was, so was with us, but then when we came off stage, our stage management team, our stage so manager, angry. was like, "Dun dun dun dun." dun. And and it's what like, the hell happened? Yeah. We're like, we're sorry, we're sorry, it'll never happen again, it'll never happen yeah. again. She's like, it was the funniest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> no, but She's like, like, don't, but don't let it happen again. again. Exactly. We're like, we won't, we won't. It just, you know, look, again, uh, stuff happens. That's what's great. But ultimately, it was probably one of the greatest. <laughs> Come on, it was oh, fun. It like, was like taking moments. a great poop because we were all just like <laughs> tense <laughs> and we just went, we just went, ah, ah. It was like, what Come on. And then we did the scene again and we got through without laughing and then the three of us ran off that stage like Charlie idiots. Underhill, the nicest man on the planet, was like, what is this, the Carol Burnett show? And we were like, oh, we were like, oh uh, no. Uh, oh, yay. Oh, yay. Thank you, Ruby Foos. Thank you, Chef Ruby. Thank you. So what do you guys remember about um, Sutton becoming a Tony winner at a young wow. age? Wow. I great. remember her looking hotter than I've ever seen like a woman. Really? She looked like no chin. Again, no, no. chin. I'm having chinless. She also had on some hot panties that night. <laughs> that everyone could see. <laughs> you looked hot. You looked so hot. Some... <laughs> I, thought, I remember, Thank you. and you getting up there and giving that speech. I, I, I like just. Oh, I was so proud. I was, was freaking so out. I didn't know what. Ooh, it's there. Yeah, I'm here. Let me move this closer. I um. There you go. This is exciting. It was surreal. That whole, that whole um, night was surreal. I remember that was the night that um, Elaine Stritch won for uh, <laughs> at, uh, oh, at right. Liberty, <laughs> and they cut her off. You know, yeah. they cut her off. They Wrong. cut off her Tony speech. And so when I went up to like the press room to have. I think about this all the time. When I went up to the press room to, um, all they asked, they did, all they did was ask me questions about how I felt about Elaine Stritch, Stritch being cut off. And I was like, I just want to. Yeah, your first Tony for and they were like, million, how do you million. feel about about what just happened to Elaine Stritch? And I'm like, my show just won on the television. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. I'm I'm locked in the rainbow room. <laughs> it was the strangest night. How are the dumplings? Really, really. Good. Really good. Really good. I mean, look at that. It's beautiful. Huh? Can we talk about something else for a sec? Yeah. I want to know, Gavin. Yeah. How Let's you're go. feeling about um, Prop Eight? Um, I really want to talk about that. Well, I he's think become an activist. Yeah, you're, you're I amazing. know. That's why I am that's becoming an activist. You are, you are really, really amazing. And I think it's nice. great you what you've me. done. I think that you know what you guys had in Times Square was amazing. Yeah, that was incredible. We wanted to go to the TKTS stairs with colored umbrellas at 6 o'clock on that Sunday, put them up and say, we're ready for a gathering storm. Are you? You know, because that was all against a response to that gathering storm. I don't know if you saw this horrible video about, there's a storm gathering. You know, they're teaching our children that gay is okay. I'm like, yeah. So, so we were, and we were going to 